this is just going to get her start to thinking. So we're going to warm her up a little bit here. Let her fall asleep on me. That'll be nice. Can you see her lips moving? Today's lesson, boys and girls, is going to be uh, disengaging the four quarters of the horse. And if you ever noticed in the pasture, how does a horse push another horse around? Or more close to home, how does a horse push you around in a barn? They stick their head in there and they put their neck and they, they move you around with their shoulders. So what we're gonna do is an exercise in respect, teaching the horse that whenever I move, I'm number one, you're number two. If I move, you want, I want the horse to shadow me. So if I move forward, I want him to move away from me. If I move back, I want her to move uh, with me. We got the brakes on the other day with disengaging the hind quarters. So let's see if we can do something about the steering wheel here in the front today. I want to get her right foot to step over the left foot. Eventually the goal is for her to be able to pivot around her hind foot 360 degrees. So if I were to draw a circle around the back leg, eventually I would want to move her front all the way around with her back foot pivoting. And that's the, that's the ultimate goal. Right now we're gonna build on it, we'll just do one step at a time. Take my stick horizontally, get into a more assertive and start to move her head this way. Around, around, there. This way, come on. There we go. Oh, come on. This. There we go. All right, good. <laughs> good. That was ballerina in the making there. Step in front. Get the cross over. There you go. One step. Good girl. Release the pressure. Whew. Okay. Let's get back to the camera somewhere. Let's go this way. Come on. There you go, there you go. All right, good. Release my pressure. What I'm trying to do is block off this angle and the front and get her to keep the door open to walk across that way. And, oh, scoot it out. Hands up, touching the air. Come on. There you go. There you go, and stop. This way, this way, this way, this way. And a girl. Good girl. Now, this way. Not this way. This way. This way. There you go. Good. Okay. Got it. Got it? Good. Not quite, but we're getting there. Pretty ugly, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I shouldn't give her those energy drinks before our workout. No more alfalfa cubes. Ready? Let's try it again. Let's go this way. Out of girl. That's it. Come on. Good. Good. One step. Relax my body. Let her read it and calm down. This stick is helping a lot because it, it just blocks her out. So touch the air. Come on. Just touch her. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Come on. Oh, good. Very good. We're going to be on Dancing with the Stars. Yeah. They take old people. Ready? Here we go. That a girl. That a girl. And I am pushing it. I am pushing it. Wow. Was that wonderful, huh? Oh, that wasn't so bad. Look at the head. Relax. Okay, got it. Got it. Okay, ready? Try that again. Okay, let's go. Come on. Come on. Not touching the horse at all. Stepping right over top. Good girl. 
Maybe you'll be a rainer when we're done with you. Ready? Here we go. Come on. That a girl. Look at that. Look at the pivot. Look at the pivot on her back. Whoa. Excellent. Excellent. Now, in the beginning, I said if I drew a circle around her back foot, she should be able to do 360. And I had my doubts there in the very beginning, but uh, she just did that for you. All right, now we get to try the other side. Let's see if we can get it going. Okay, ready? Ooh, not bad. Not bad at all, little girl. Okay, ready? Lift it a little higher so she can't duck under. Step in front of her. Good, my belly button's about even with her eyeball. That's where I should be keeping that hand up so she can't duck under. If she tries to walk out on me, if you notice, well, good girl, I'm holding, I'm holding it here. So she walks up, I bump her a little bit on her, on her nose so she can't walk forward. Keep this high, the block's this way. She can't duck under, and if I need to, I can tap her with the heel of my stick on the shoulder, because we don't want her just bending the neck around. They're trying to get away from you. What she, we want to do is move those shoulders. So we want the whole neck, head, and shoulders. The neck, head, and shoulders. Sounds like a shampoo commercial. We want the whole thing to move, okay? Well, I'll tell you what. Let's just try this side without the stick now. Okay, ready? Same thing. Not touching you, I'm not touching you, I'm not touching you, I'm not touching you. Are we there yet? Yes, we're there. Mom, he's annoying me. Well, just move away from him, dear. Okay. I'm not touching you. I'm not touching you. I'm not touching you. Not touching, not touching, not touching. Are we there? Yep. So if I want to, come on. Move the back end. Good. Okay, and let's move the front end. I had no idea she could do this. Very nice. Very smart. Yes, aw shucks. Hang your head. You did good. How about that, huh? Alright. <laughs> I'm very proud of you.